Hi, Bladen. Hi. Uh, we see a lot of bees in, behind you. What is that about? Is it a beehive? Uh, this is the application, but this is the product that we have here in the Cafe Europa. And the idea is to, uh, to invite citizens to, to map the city of the Mons from their own perspective with using this uh, particular application that we call Beehive. Yeah. So one, once they film the video, all the video, videos are geolocalized and sent directly to the database. Okay. And what we do is uh, we suggest them the list of the teams. They are really built into the philosophy of the Cafe Europa project here. And there are teams like really important to deal with, to think about for, for nowadays society. Starting from food, recycling, uh, mobility, uh, sustainable development, uh, heritage, uh, and okay. biodiversity, social divers diversity. Why the, the format of a cafe? Yeah, that's, that's a nice story. Actually, this is the place uh, for, for, uh, for new technologies and digital fabrications. And when you, when you speak to someone about uh, digital fabrications and new technologies, the, I, I, one of the first things you have is about MIT institutes, uh, schools, uh, like you know, kind of cold spaces uh, okay. reserved for certain, uh, certain uh, people that circulate certain uh, certain audience. And the cafe uh, for, for us uh, here is really like uh, one of the first cultural units uh, uh, way back of, uh, in, in, in Vienna where, where the cafe was uh, the place of uh, exchange the knowledge uh, ideas, mm -hmm. it was kind of creative hub. So we, we, stick, we took this uh, notion of cafe as a creative hub and bring it to the 21st century. Uh, so we place all the activities in, inside of the place that is mm. warm, that is convivial, that is uh, open for everyone and uh, yeah, more uh, leger. This system of the screens, uh, we use it now for the, for the Beehive application, but normally we use it as a one screen uh, with a video conferencing to be connected with uh, with other cities. So we have um, uh, we had a, we had a do-it-yourself activity together with four European cities being connected and working uh, at the same time on the on the a model of solar panel. Okay. So we are all amateurs, but we, we we connect to each other and we start working on the same model of the solar panel, trying to understand how to build it together. Then, for example, we have international lunch. We cook together, together with one city, and uh, in the meantime we speak a lot about food because food is a really topic to be discussed today. So for example, we, if you use tomatoes here, we, we ask uh, our Russian colleagues how they grow tomatoes, what does it mean, was it, what does it mean to, to, to grow tomatoes in Russia now, uh, how much it costs. And we eat, we enjoy, and, but we at the same time learn a, a lot about uh, the food. For me, it's completely nat natural that uh, all these kind of packets, branches uh, uh, match together uh, nowadays. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you think about ar art, mm -hmm. it changed the notions a lot since the last uh, 30 years. Uh, right. You know, that, uh, what we are doing here, uh, we have artist residencies as well, but uh, we, don't label, we, uh, we don't label usual activities as, the, as artistic activities or less artistic activities. Mm -hmm. It's, uh, we can speak more about the like, general notion of cre creativity. Thank you very much. Ciao, ciao. Ciao.